Uh, I wish to uh, raise a matter this evening for the Minister for, uh, for Energy. And uh, can I express my very, very deep concern about the impending uh, energy crisis uh, that is about to hit us? And uh, can I say that uh, I am uh, uh, very distressed by reports that I am receiving um, of, of elderly people who um, are hard up uh, for, for uh, dollars uh, going to bed uh, at lunchtime just to keep warm. I think, it's, um, I think it's deplorable that uh, we have a situation where the best we can offer somebody who has worked all their life, uh, all their life uh, has paid taxes all their life, the best we can do in their, in their twilight years is we say to them, you go to bed at lunchtime and stay in bed for the rest of the day just to keep warm, just to keep warm. That, to my way of thinking, uh, is, is just not acceptable not acceptable in a civilised society. Now, this, uh, this uh, as I say, this impending energy crisis is really going to hit the west of Melbourne very, very hard. Uh, there are a lot, of, a lot of battlers out in the west, uh, people who work very, very hard, they pay their taxes, they raise their families, uh, they, they live... Um, um, very close to the wind in terms of, of finances, uh, but uh, they they are good, honourable, decent people, and they are going to they are going to be hit by this thing. And the, the thing that really annoys me more than anything else is that this crisis that we're talking about is man man made. It's man made. You, you don't have to look uh, too far to see that this can be avoided uh, very very simply. Very, very simply, and I'm asking the Minister tonight to do just that, to do just that. The fact that uh, we don't have enough, enough electricity, the fact that we don't have enough gas can be solved very quickly. You don't, you don't need a meeting of the great minds of Australia to come up with a solution uh, to this, to this uh, particular situation. We have over 300 years' worth of coal down in the Latrobe Valley. If we, if we use that, uh, if we use that to, uh, to make more electricity, then that obviously is going to help the situation. If we allow uh, the drilling for, for, uh, for gas, uh, natural gas, then obviously that is going to help. Uh, so I, uh, what I'm asking the Minister to do uh, tonight uh, is, is to put aside, put aside this nonsense of, uh, of, a, of a climate emergency, which does not exist and I doubt ever will, um, and, and take on board the very real concerns, the very real concerns of average Victorians, uh, Victorian families, as well as Victorian workers, who are absolutely terrified of what's coming. Use the resources that we have, and this so-called crisis will go away. It is not a difficult proposition for the Minister to understand. Even she should be able to.